Hello, and welcome to Bits, Bytes, and Barrels 101. Uh, my name is Jeffrey Can, and I'm your resident instructor and expert on the impacts of digital technology on the oil and gas industry. This course is designed to help you, the oil and gas industry professional, the digital professional, the supplier, or the regulator, or the financier, prepare for the coming disruption to the oil and gas industry caused by digital innovations. A gamification means adopting software features that first started in the video gaming world and bringing those into the business world. There are many different features of video games that are of value to oil and gas, and those include competition, addiction, and execution excellence. What kind of value does gamification actually release? Well, first, there is the significant potential for productivity improvement. Imagine a facility that operates at 75 or 80% of its theoretical capacity. Now, introduce game concepts to the teams of people who are running that plant, creating a competition to improve the performance shift over shift, using points and badges, stars, collectibles, and rewards. The experience of companies that have introduced gamification in this way has been to improve the performance of assets and improve the productivity of those assets. Many other industries are much further ahead, including the food industry, who print dishes and desserts. In Asia, in drive through restaurants, customers can buy 3D printed food. Footwear, eyewear, dental tools, and surgical tools are now being 3D printed. The second kind of digital reality is called virtual reality. In virtual reality, a user will don a headset that completely blocks the outside world. And the only thing they can see is what is presented on the little screen in front of their eyes. They no longer see the real world. They see only a virtual world or a virtual reality. People can be placed anywhere doing anything, from swimming underwater with whales, to walking in space, to touring a large and complex facility. Augmented, virtual, and mixed realities form this domain called digital reality. I see it as a way of doing data visualization, helping humans understand the complexities in the real world of working with data.